What's up, folks? Been checking my line, haven't got anything so far. Uh, I set a couple yesterday. These are on a trail. My deer stand's up there. You can't see it, but it comes down in the back. There's a rock thing, troubles like an L from down there by my deer stand. Comes all the way up this trail. This trail's been cut here for years. But I made this one yesterday. Something was here messing with it last night. You can see it dug out the whole side of it right here. But obviously never stepped on the damn trap. You can see it's all dug out. That wasn't like that yesterday. May have been a coon, who knows. But I got one up that way at the top of the trail and I actually caught something in it and lost it. And that so irritating. I'd rather have nothing than a mess but this here comes down there's a little field out that way where i come through and this goes right down underneath my deer's in there it is up there right up there in the center But I'm gonna leave this. I ain't even gonna mess with it. They even put me a CD there. There's really nowhere to hang anything. I know I've seen bobcats up on this rock ridge all through the years. And I know they have a trail going down through here because I've seen them deer hunting. They come across my center trail up there and they come right through here and they come right down this embankment. So I figured I'd set one last year. I said I was going to do it, and I never did. So I'm just trying new things this year. Like the one up there, uh, I had to, when I first got my camera, I put it up there and uh, actually had a video of a bobcat passing right through there. So that's another reason why I did it. another bobcat sit there. But. I'm putting in bobcat sets because there's not many yotes, so just doing what I can. And I'm still learning every day anyway, so especially on these dang cats, they're, they're my nemesis. They seem to be the hardest to catch for me, so I'll just leave this like it is. I might move that leaf out of the center of that, though. And then, uh, See where it goes from there. All right, folks. When I get back up here, I'll show you, show you my other set. Thanks. All right, folks. I'm back up here. Right there's where I just came from. Right down that trail. Comes up to this T. That's the back corner where I go over there to the pond. I come up this way, and it goes up to my deer stand. So this is a T right here. But right here, so there's a spot where they come through, something comes through there, I know the coons do. But it's got like this uh, cul-de-sac thing here I'm, I've made into it. But I don't think the cat circle's that big. I'm hoping it was just a coon. And not a bobcat. But this is just the way it's left. Had uh, some grass mowed up along here from when I mowed this. And it had like a little hole type thing. So I wiggled it out and made it look like a mouse hole. Made, put a pretty good sized hole down in there. And stack some grass and sticks around the sides of it made it into a bobcat set and uh, a little step over i put like a little dirt mound step over set in my bobcat sets they have to step over the dirt so i'm gonna remake this and then i'll show it to you guys hold on all right folks i'm back with you i got it remade it's not as perfect as it was the first time when I made it, but I got it pretty close. 
So you can see all the, the grass. I got some uh, white feathers hanging out the hole, which I did before too. It's got to step over this and I got my pan lower right in the middle than anywhere. So I'll step right down in the middle of that. But I don't know how well you can see it. The sun is coming from that way. That's my remake, and we'll see how we do. All right, I gotta still go over here by the pond, other pond across the street from me. So if I get anything there, I'll bring it back with you. If not, sorry for no catches today, folks. I had a catch and had a loss, so I lost it. But better luck next time, that's trapping for you. But I ain't gonna give up. But hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and give me a comment, please. I'd like to hear what you think. Uh, tell me what you think about this. And I got that other one down there fixed. So hopefully it will uh, do good. Back here where I go, had nothing in the as a pond. I've, I've only gotten one raccoon back here. And, so I just went ahead and pulled them. That's a pain in the butt going through that gate and going all the way through back there uh, just for three P DPs that ain't doing very good. So I may put them back again later. Who knows? But Wednesday, cross street in my crop fields. Uh, I'll be setting up coyote sets, uh, DPs down in the creek beds. Uh, I got s planned out for over there, so. And then uh, a little further over this year, I get to trap uh, another part of the, the bean field, or the crop field, over by uh, Old Missile site. So it ought to be interesting. I'm anxious to get in there and get some traps set up over there. So I'll be bringing that to you. And I may, this other fellow that gave me permission, I'm gonna try to go up in there and see how his grass is. He didn't mow it a second time. Some some guys they like to go trapping anything, but I'm I'm not digging up a bunch of three foot grass to put a trap in. <laughs> Sorry, that's just me. Huh. To each his own. But that's a, that's a lot of work. But I'm gonna get on down the line here and get across the street and see what I got set up over there at the pond. Hopefully I didn't get skunked over there today. All right, folks, later. What's up, folks? Got nothing for you today. I'm sorry. I'm over here at the pond. I got skunked. Not one single trap over here. I got anything in it. But boy, it sure is a beautiful day. Look at that, how beautiful that is. You can't beat this. City life sucks. Country life, look at this. You can't beat it. It's so good to be alive when you're in the country. It's good to be alive. I shouldn't be here after what happened to me this year and I've been having a lot of good things happen. Got my big buck, got another red fox. May not got no yotes yet, but I'll tell you what. It's a beautiful day. There you go, folks. Hopefully I'll be getting all that over there set up. All back there, and it goes way over there. Some more crop fields I'll get to do this year. Come Wednesday, I'll be setting up, brothers. Get ready. All right. Hit that subscribe button. Tell me what you think. Later, folks.